Good evening, Folsom High. It's Thursday, August 29th, and it's back to school night. Welcome to all of our parents. I'm Owen Garianti. And I'm Sebastian Ayala. We're the hosts of the Bulldog Daily Bulletin this week here on Channel 8. Tonight we have some words of welcome from our principal, Mr. Cadenhead, and then some brief information from staff and parent volunteers. So stay tuned, and let's make it a great night to be a Bulldog. I'm Howard Cadenhead. I'm the principal at Folsom High School. Welcome to our back to school night. We're happy to see everybody here tonight. It's a great opportunity for all of you to get to know your students teachers and to hear a little bit about expectations and how your student can be successful and how you can support your student in their effort to be successful here at Folsom High School. So thank you for being here and for your time. Um, I also want to share some important messages about some of the work we've been doing for the last year and a half here. We've partnered with Stanford University and their Challenge Success Program um, to do a better job of addressing um, our whole student here at Folsom High School and making sure that our uh, students achieve some balance in their lives. We want them to be successful academically, obviously, and we want them to push themselves and achieve. We also want them to be happy. Um, we want them to be healthy. Um, and one of the things that we talk about through our experience with Stanford is what we call PDF or playtime, downtime, family time. So within the schedule and hectic schedule that they have at Folsom High School and the demands that are obviously placed on them both here and outside of school, we want them to schedule time with you, with their family. We want them to have downtime to themselves where they get to decide what they do. It's important for kids. They don't get chances very often these days to play anymore. We want them to have family time, play time, downtime. It's something that we've preserved a little bit throughout our day with our transition times and also with our pause program, giving them choice in how they spend their time. The other thing that we've learned a lot about from our challenge success experience is um, the importance of students and families defining the term success. So um, I would challenge all of you to sit with your student and talk about what it means in your family to be successful. I would ask your student, what do you think I think success means as a parent? How would I define this if I was telling you? Ask them what they say. Then ask them what they define as success in their life. It's important for them to have goals, obviously, in the next four years to eight years, um, whether that's career or personal goals or family goals uh, for achievement and otherwise. So is that about money? Is that about security? Is that about travel? Is that about just happiness? Is that about raising a family and having a happy family? Um, there are all kinds of ways that we all define um, you know, success in our lives and it's important I think that our kids hear what it is within our family units, not for us to define at school, but for you to define as a family. So I would, ex I would please challenge you to have that, that conversation with your child and if you um, would like to share that with us, that's great, but we're trying to move our practice so that again our kids are balanced, happy, and healthy here at Folsom High School. So thank you again for joining us tonight. I know that it's a busy night and your lives are busy and you're taking time to do something really important and support the kids. So have a great night. Good evening. My name is Sherry Berry and I'm your PTSA president this year. In case you were wondering, PTSA stands for Parent Teacher Student Association. As a part of this team of amazing parents, teachers, and student representatives, we are excited to see your children back at Folsom High School. It doesn't matter if you have a senior counting down the days or a freshman just wondering where their next class is located. We are all part of the Bulldog family, a family that takes care of each other, and that is exactly what the PTSA does for you. One of our roles is to raise funds to pay for vital programs on the Folsom High campus. With the generous support of parents and staff, the PTSA has been making a difference by sponsoring programs that impact every student in this school. Some of you watching right now might have had children who became recipients of college scholarships that are funded by the PTSA. This year we are helping to fund a program called Challenge Success, a company dedicated to helping students cope with the constant stressors of school life. We also offer programs such as SAT and ACT practice tests, reflections, every 15 minutes, and many more. In fact, we have our first SAT practice test coming up on Saturday, 
September 7th from 8 a.m. to 11.30 a.m. It's in the multipurpose room. Bring $20 and arrive early to secure your spot. Some exciting news is that we are now selling Bulldog clothing online. You can access our online store through the PTSA link on the Folsom High website. If you order by Tuesday, you can pick up your purchase in student accounts on Friday. It is our goal as an organization to help Folsom High School be the best educational experience possible for everyone. So how can you help? We would love for each family to become a member of the PTSA. At a $10 membership fee, if every family joins, we can raise enough to make a difference. You may have also heard about Bucks for Bulldogs. This is a direct ask fundraiser. And with these funds, we can make an even larger and more positive impact on the lives of our students. Donate before August 31st to be entered into the raffle. This year, we are trying to raise money to buy a new electronic marquee for the student quad. This will help remind all students of upcoming Bulldog events. Your donation of time is also appreciated, but becoming a, P a member of the PTSA does not mean you have to volunteer. It if you would like to get involved, we can match you with something that suits your availability. If not, we just appreciate your support so we can continue to fund these much needed projects. You can go to fcusd.org slash Folsom High PTSA to join and donate online, or you can come see us in the quad tonight to sign up. So I say welcome, good luck, and thank you for your support. Hello everyone, my name is Michelle Piazzoni and I am the Senior Chair for Sober Grad Night 2020. Sober Grad Night is a fun, supervised, and sober celebration for our graduates immediately following the ceremony. And the price of the ticket includes all of the food, activities, and prizes the night has to offer. It's a Folsom High tradition that's been going on for more than 30 years and we consistently have at least 80% attendance. It's a win-win for students and parents. The graduates get to celebrate with all of their friends and the parents and community know that they're in a safe environment. I know you're thinking school just started, but planning a party of this magnitude requires a lot of advanced preparation and we've already started. In fact, our biggest fundraiser of the year is just around the corner on October 19th at Zittle Farms. It's called Cow Pie Bingo. In case you're not familiar with this unusual fundraiser, let me explain. The cow pasture at Zittles is marked into a grid of 1,600 squares, which are numbered randomly. You purchase a ticket with a number that corresponds to one of those squares. We feed the cow pumpkin and set her to work in the pasture. Whichever square in which the cow pie drops is the lucky winner of $1,000. Each of the four squares cornering that lucky square win $100. It's not really a spectator sport, so you need not be present to win, but everyone is invited to attend. We encourage everyone to play along with Cow Pie Bingo and support Sober Grad Night. The funds raised from this event roll over from year to year, so every class benefits. We ask senior parents to buy 10 tickets. They can keep them or resell them to friends and neighbors. Tickets are just $5 each and they're on sale tonight in the quad. So before I go, just one more thing. Even though Sober Grad Night is an event for seniors, we rely on parents of students of all ages to help us. You can imagine what's involved keeping four to 500 students entertained from 9 p.m. till 4 a.m. in the morning. So whether you want to get involved in planning now or help on the night of the event, look for information in the Bulldog Bulletin or contact us at FolsomSGN.com. And thanks for your support. I'm Elizabeth Sisson. I'm an assistant principal in charge of Alpha Letters A through D, and I just want to welcome you to the 2019-2020 school year. Have a wonderful year. Hey, hi guys. I'm Mrs. Morales. My alphabet is E through K. Welcome back. I'm Mr. Eklund, and I'm responsible for students L through P. 
Hi, I'm Greg Cronel, responsible for Alpha Q through Z. Looking forward to seeing all your kids this year and I hope you have a fantastic year. Good evening, my name is Cliff Castro and I am Folsom's Activities Director and that means that I supervise the student government class which puts on the uh, most of the events and activities of the school year. It also means that I'm the person you contact if you have any questions about blood drives, homecomings, dances, rallies, senior balls, junior prom, um, and so on. Um, I'd also like to invite you to check out our activities website, which is on the Folsom webpage, and there you'll find contact information, club information, um, important documents, uh, and class updates. Uh, so I'm excited for what I'm sure will be a fantastic school year and as the year progresses if you have any questions or concerns please uh, feel free to contact me. Hi I'm Lisa Finley and I'm the athletic director here at Folsom High School. We have 17 sports programs and 41 teams compete throughout the year so there's many opportunities for students to get involved and represent the Folsom Bulldogs. We are so proud of our athletes as many of our varsity athletes have gone into playoffs, won section championships, and even state championships. We have extremely hardworking coaches who have dedicated themselves to making Folsom High School athletics a force to be reckoned with. Athletics is also a great way to show your Bulldog pride and community spirit, so come on out and watch our Bulldogs battle it out at many sporting events all school year long. If you have any questions about Folsom Athletics, you can contact me at the high school or go to our website for more information. So let's go Bulldogs! Hi, my name is Officer Bates and I am assigned to Folsom High School and I take care of Sutter Middle School as well. And I'm here if you guys need anything, just stop by my office and I'm here most school days, Monday through Thursday. Hi, I'm Lisa Prenti and I'm a campus monitor. Hi, I'm Leonora Torres and I'm a campus monitor. Have a great year. Hi, my name is Marvin Lisberger. We do campus security and uh, we just want to let you know that we're out here to not only supervise the campus, protect the campus and the students and staff, but we're here for you guys. So if you guys have any questions, concerns, where to go, whatever, come find any one of us. And uh, we want to wish you all have a great year. All right, some good information there. Remember that if you want to follow up, there are links to most of those people and organizations on the high school website. That's www.fcusd.org slash FHS. That's it for us tonight. First period now continues for about 15 minutes until 645. Shout out to all the teachers here at Folsom High. He's Owen and I'm Sebastian. Let's make it a great night to be a Bulldog.